grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. When Faith is Silenced is from Dr. David Jeremiah's Turning Points with God, 365 Daily Devotions, July 9th entry. Behold, you will be mute and not able to speak until the day these things take place, because you did not believe my words, which will be fulfilled in their own time. Luke 1.20 Throughout the Bible, there are special promises regarding the births of certain babies, the promise to Abraham about Isaac, the prediction of Samson's birth, the message to Mary regarding Christ, and the encounter of Zacharias with the angel who foretold the birth of John the Baptist. Whenever God speaks, he expects us to trust. Mary had confidence in the promise, saying, Let it be to me according to your word. Luke 1 38. Zacharias was more incredulous. How shall I know this? For I am an old man, and my wife is well advanced in years. Luke 1 18. His doubt silenced his tongue, and for nine months, Zacharias had nothing to say. When God gives a promise, it's best to believe him instantly. His word is infallible, and his promises never fail. They are to be taken at face value, or else our faith is silenced. To end, a quote from Augustus Strong, we are to abide in him by an entire consecration and to let him abide in us by an appropriating faith. We are to give ourselves to Christ and to take in return the Christ who gives himself to us. In other words, we are to believe Christ's promises and to act upon them. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you. Amen.